Hey guys, I'm J Mac with Mac Attack Poke Breaks, and I'm rebuilding my Pokemon collection. Um, not quite sure. I don't really remember what I have in here. So this is from Tea Leaf Collectibles, a dollar twenty-five to ship off of eBay. Not bad at all. Let's see what we got here. Oh, it's taped down. Oh, okay, looks like a freebie because I don't remember getting that one. Possibly Korean. Uh, maybe Japanese. I'm not even going to pretend because I don't know the languages, but very cool little throwing card. All right. Electro. Duh. Electrode. Jungle Hollow. Ooh, very nice. I don't really see any any scratches really at all on that hollow. Um, let's see what the back looks like. A little bit of chipping to be expected. Nothing wrong with that. Oh, uh, that's that's a clean card. I like that. So it's kind of fitting that I got the uh, other little Vol Voltorb, I guess, and then. Rotom, I think. Some of these newer Pokemons, I don't remember. And again, either Korean, Japanese. Uh, still, cool little throw-ins. So, these came kind of as a bundle, and I needed both of them. Uh, this is the non-holo. Still looks very clean. Alright. Back looks good. Just a little bit of chip here and there. Nothing major sweet so i'll take those very nice very nice i'm still trying to decide what to start building back i don't know if i want team rocket jungle fossil um just haven't really decided so i've just been kind of when i think of something or see something at a decent price i get it all right so this is general grievous 2012 it only costs 20 cents to ship normal envelope so let's see here. I'll make sure there's not any addresses or anything showing. All right. So we're definitely taped up here. <laughs> Come on now. Okay, the cards definitely were not going anywhere. All right, and so that is a far fetched reverse hollow that. I did not order. There it is, a wheezing from the fossil set. Okay, are we sideways here? It's kind of hard to tell. Thought it was like a team bag, but it's the only thing I don't like. I appreciate the extra packaging, but whenever I shipped on eBay, I made sure that it was fairly easy to take everything apart off and so that my customer didn't have to spend a lot of time trying to undo tape. Now the only bad thing is if these aren't sleeved, there's a chance that tape could have you know gotten up against there. But alright. Far fetched, freebie, a little bit of damage, no big deal, but that's kind of a cool far fetched. Galarian far fetched at that. Right, another freebie. Uh, damage up the top, but again, it was free. Can't really complain. Got another little dent right there. Okay, these are what I ordered. So these were basically replacements from my last fossil purchase. Um, just there were just a lot of cards that. Once I started looking at them closer off camera, had a lot of like uh, dings, dents, teeth marks. I don't know. You know, it's not bad. Um, so I just decided to replace them. I found some fairly cheap for replacements, just a couple bucks to get them. And those are really clean cards. Those look pretty good. Yeah. So I'd say those are worth a couple bucks to replace. And one of the reasons why I got went ahead and got those was because same seller had this hollow muck. 
I got some scratches, but again, I mean, I, that's kind of why I expect buying these. And plus, I'm not spending, you know, buying the most expensive cards out there. You know, got a little bit of edge wear. In the backs, a little more edge wear and chipping than I really want, but I think I only spent like six bucks on the card. So, um, I can, I can live with that for sure. And then we have the wheezing. Yes. All right. Pretty clean card on the front. Decent on the back, just corners, edges. So again, just to replace the ones that were pretty bad shape. Um, so I got a couple of hollows in today. Super excited about that. Now, also, my local store, I was able to purchase some other cards. And this is what's, I guess, kind of hindering me on my uh, ability to finish or figure out which vintage set I want is I'm a sucker for promo cards. And there are a lot out there. So, pick that up. I think I spent a couple bucks on that. Most of these around the dollar to two dollar range. Lucario V Star, another Black Star promo. Um, basically, what it was it's a a game exchange where you can take, you know, all kinds of stuff. Video games, another Lucario. Love the texture on these. So cool. Um, cards, sports cards, electronics, and give them. You know, they give you store credit. You know, not much, but. <clears throat> Anyways, I had some store credit, so. I just decided to get some of the promo cards that I like, thought looked cool. And some that uh, I needed for other sets because opening cards with my daughter. I've been getting a lot of the Fusion, um, Evolving Skies, and there is a few others, Obsidian Flames, so... Alolan Rachu. Now, I don't know what set this is from. So I'm going to have to look that up, but I saw there was only 30 in a set. Thought that might be kind of fun to collect, but sometimes these smaller sets, those cards can jump in price, just depending on what they are. So that's one I need to look up. Radiant Jirachi, I know I picked that up for a buck. I just thought it was cool because it was Radiant. But anyway, that's store credit, so I kind of went a little shopping spree. Um, Mewtwo GX. Got some scratches on it, but I just thought it was cool. Um, I like the little Mewtwo emblem there. Again, no clue what set that's from, so I've got to do a little Pokemon research. What else we got? Uh, Surfing Pikachu VMAX Celebrations. I think I got a couple of those. Yeah, there's the Flying Pikachu. I thought these were cool. Again, coming back in the hobby that, you know, there's a whole decade that I've missed of Pokemon cards. Latias, um, I just thought that was a cool looking card. Again, picked it up for a buck. Thought that was pretty sweet. Mimikyu EX, another promo. And they've come a long way on their hollows from the uh, originals. You, know, you got to hold them just right where these almost any way you hold them you got something changing but i will say though i still like the old school stuff eligos uh, another promo that was the only reason why i got it like i said i'm kind of a sucker for promos um if i find ones i don't have for around that dollar or two i'm probably going to get them galarian articuno um i love legendary birds i think they're awesome so Happy to get that one. Let's see. Well, bad thing is usually the uh, vintage cards are in horrible shape that the store I go to has. It's another Pika promo. So it's more for buying modern. All right. Uh, Fusion Strike. I needed this to work on that set. I believe the rest of these should be Fusion Strike. Let's see what we got. Yeah, Chandelier V Max. That's such a cool card. I love the coloring on it. So again, another Fusion Strike. Shiny 
Chandler V. Then what's the last one here? Breloom. All right, so again, some fusion strike I needed. Kind of working on modern sets while I'm working on my Venice sets. Um, I definitely want to get the Venice sets done, but as I'm opening packs with my daughter and getting other stuff, it's kind of hard not to collect other stuff. So <laughs> I need to do a better job focusing. But did get a couple of hollows today, a few freebies. Um, let's see, where is it? Right there. So... Those are my two main big boys that I got today. Still trying to decide if I want to go Fossil Jungle, Team Rocket, um, or Base. But until I make a definite decision, I'll just kind of pick up a little bit here and there and see what I can come up with. So, all right. Thank you for watching. I hope if you're uh, pulling, you're having some awesome luck. Hope, um, you know, if there's sets you're trying to complete, you're able to find what you need because sometimes it's a little hard. Or, that card that you need that only costs a dollar ends up costing six, seven dollars by the time you pay shipping and taxes off of other sites. So it can be kind of pain in the butt trying to find some of the stuff. But anyway, hope you're having fun collecting. Hope you have a blessed day and we'll see you next time. Bye.